hey guys hope you're all doing well welcome back to my channel thank you so much for always coming back to watch my videos in case you're new here welcome my name is Dee Mwango from Kenya Mama Africa and uh, I basically travel the world I'm a world world traveler I've been to right now almost 60 now 60 countries around the world so I recently came back home actually I came back home yesterday yeah yesterday from zanzibar so um welcome back home so right now i'm doing this intro from my room you know what i mean and uh, i just freshened up and i'm like let me see what's up today so i just had my mom just came i came yesterday and i didn't see her so uh, i just heard her voice i want to be saying hello to her then i want to be taking you guys along there's something that just happened a few minutes ago and i was like you know what i mean when you're like <laughs> anyway i want to let you guys know what's up so please remember to subscribe hit that like button leave a comment let me know what to think about today's video for my returning subscribers thank you so much my voice right now is a little bit rough i can say because i just literally woke up i traveled yesterday so we drove yesterday from nairobi back home then i went to my brother's place and all that i slept really late around three three or four am in the morning so i just i just woke up and it's midday you know what i mean but rest is really 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 needed so hopefully as we go by my voice will be will be back to normal because i can even hear myself and let me know what you guys think about my new hairstyle trust me i thought new york city was the most expensive place to do my hair so far but i came back to my country and i did this hairstyle at uh, i think it's julio locks along mombasa road if you've ever been there i don't know but actually they do really a good job but guess what 45,000 Kenyan, not actually 45, but 49 to do the locks and also to color. Do you know? I don't, it's so, I was like, what? But I did this because when I start traveling, I don't want to be like, oh, today it's a bad hair day. Who will do my hair? Because with the locks, it's so easy. We just retouch and you keep going. So still, I thought, oh, as long as I don't get tired, I get, but I love locks. I don't think I'll get tired. I was like, still, it's worth it. Saving time and and worries. Let me know what you guys think for 45,000 Kenyan shillings. That's around maybe 400 US dollars or not less than 350, depending on the exchange rate. <laughs> I was like, yo, but it's really nice. You know, Julio, I think it's Julio, Julio locks along Mombasa Road. Yeah, it's really a good job though. Anyway, that enough. Congrats, mom just came back. That's her bed. Welcome back home. <laughs> the sun is hot. The sun, the sun is sunning. You know what I mean? Yeah, let me. Oh, the windows are open. The sun back home is, is kind of really hot. Unlike the capital, it's kind of cold, you know? So, welcome back home, guys. And in case you're new here, this is where I come from. This is where I call home. And uh, I'm just so happy to be back. Because last time I was here, I didn't even spend even three days. I was here just for like two days. Then I went to Mombasa where I was really having a good time. Then I went to Zanzibar. So I just came back home now. It feels good to be home. The sun. Yeah. La Grande, how you doing? <laughs> <laughs> you missed me, right? I am back. So what are you saying? Yeah? This is La Grande. It's so happy. You see how it's shaking the tail. That's to say, he's so happy. It's a male dog. All is good. I want to tell you how to travel. I wanna, not, not you, but Bossy and Boka. So we can travel together. Because out there, people travel with their dogs. Hmm? <laughs> no! <laughs> what? 
Eh, anyway guys, welcome back home. Hmm? I think my mom is on this other side. There's a lot of construction going on, but I think, I don't know why they, they rust. Maybe they should be kept outside so they don't rust. I've heard congrats mom voice somewhere, somewhere. Congrats, mom. How are you? I just heard your voice. Come, 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 come. How are you? How was church? Oh, church has been so well. Uh -huh. I was the preacher of the day. Eh, you are the preacher of the day. And you are sweating. It's hot, right? Yes. It's really hot. It's really hot. I've not eaten. Why? You are fasting? No. I, I had just come. I wanted to attend my chicken i think this is your favorite dress all the time i'm home she's always in this dress <laughs> <laughs> not really my favorite uh -huh. but i just found myself in it <laughs> but you know, you know i had that coat of it oh the coat yeah, yeah it, because it's hot another peter and i've decided to let me see what she's carrying so right here we have a lot of eggs eh fresh eggs Yes, that's what now I was explaining to her, mm -hmm. that the lady who was here, mm -hmm. she was disastrous to my chicken, <laughs> because you can see what was happening. <laughs> they are so dirty. Why? And it looks like there's a lot of rats here, you see? Maybe they are eating the eggs. Yes. Yeah. So, All right. so I need to do something about them. Mm -hmm. So what did you preach about today? Okay, today was about the love of God, and our key text was from the book of Peter, Chapter 3, uh, verse, um, verse 16. Mm -hmm. So it was, yes. What did it say? Yes, it was saying about mm -hmm. that uh, we have come now to the end. We are, we are approaching the end. The what, end of what? The world? No, we are approaching the end to hear this word of Christ. Mm -hmm. And this word talks about humility, peace, forgiveness, uh, integrity and uh, helping one another. <laughs> you see? Okay. Then what is the story that you gave? Because I know before you preach, you give them a story. Or right now things have changed. No, I had to give a, a story. Mm -hmm. And my story, biblical story, came from the book of Samuel, First mm -hmm. Samuel, chapter one. Mm -hmm. And it was talking about Elkanah, mm -hmm. who had two wives. Mm -hmm. So the first wife. Mm -hmm. Uh, there was Hannah and Penina. Uh -huh. So Penina had children, but Hannah did not have. Mm -hmm. So Penina could uh, mock Han, mm -hmm. saying that she should not be given food. Mm -hmm. The same to her, because her, she had children, but Han did not have. So eventually, this story was driving us to know how to pray to God, that everything you do, if you pray, with sincerity, God will answer your prayer. So, Anne, all the time, Anne used to pray mm -hmm. so hard. Mm -hmm. All the time, she was praying in the temple uh -huh. until Come the, inside. until, uh -huh. God uh, blessed her. Until this, uh, you know, in the church, they had the priest Eli, who was taking care of uh, God's people in the church. Uh -huh. Priest Eli was asking Hannah, why do you open your mouth all the time in the church? Then Han told him that I have a, a problem that I pray for. I don't give birth, I don't have children. So when priest Ellie had this, mm -hmm. I prayed for her and told mm -hmm. her go. When she reached her home, she reconceived. And she used to tell God that if God, if you will answer my prayers. I will let this child serve you forever in church. Yes, so you know uh, the Bible. So, <laughs> so, so she used to pray that God may give. I did religion. May, may you know? God give her a son and you know this son was named samuel and this lady dedicated the son to stay in the lord's temple throughout his life and uh, he became the servant of god mm -hmm. that was the story that i gave in the side of the storytelling to prepare the the, the congregation for the main someone yeah for the main someone <laughs> that so, was good so this this prayer this prayer of Han, we need to emulate Anne, Han, how she used to pray. And her faith made her reconceive. Mm -hmm. so, so it's all about faith. Yeah, it's all about prayer and faith. Because she knew that one day God will answer her prayers. Yeah. And indeed God answered her prayers. 
and that was about today's sermon. Oh, that's so good because I woke up, I went down to take tea and I realized nobody was around yes. and I knew you had gone to church. Th- there's your, I think sh- that he said she's your cousin. Let her come yeah. out. I nearly chased your cousin away. Uh, sorry, sorry. I nearly oh chased God, her God. away. Do you know you what? Do you know what? <laughs> Uh, this one, <laughs> let me introduce her. Now, let me tell you. Yes. I went to drink tea and yes. I found her. I was like, this pretty Wait, lady, you, where is she from? Are you a YouTuber? And I was like, she was like, oh, D. Wongo, nice to me. When somebody says D. Wongo, I know this is somebody who watches my YouTube videos oh, because yes. not everybody <laughs> calls me that. A normal person who don't, doesn't know much about me, they don't call me that. Yeah. So I was like, when did you come? I came yesterday. Because when I woke up, I realized, you know, there were there was so many shoes. Like, you can realize there's somebody around, yes. but I wasn't sure who it was. Mm-hmm. So I went to drink tea. She came and said, oh, D, nice to meet you, blah, blah, blah. I said, when did you come? Uh, then she told me. Then I was like, are you a YouTuber? Because when she said D. Wango, I knew this person must be knowing things to do with YouTube. Yes. Then I said, eh, me, people who do YouTube, I don't want even to see them around me. You know yes. what I mean? I was like, let me go and ask D. How comes? I always tell you people not to welcome people who do YouTube videos here. <laughs> so how did you manage to welcome her uh-huh. till she's staying here and the fact that I'm around? Yes. So in my mind, I was like, I think this lady is around because she was told I'm around. Yes. And I always tell you, do not do that because yes. I don't do those things. When I'm back home, I don't want to meet people who create YouTube videos yes. at home. Yes. So it's like, I think the problem is my mom because my mom and Mara, they don't have limits. They just yeah. welcome people <laughs> who end up to be really bad people. Like really. My mom has welcomed people who, until I look back and I'm like, you know, if it wasn't for Mara and my mom, we yes. couldn't be having these problems because yes. you people welcome so many people yes. and you don't know when they go out there they mm. turn out to be something else you yes. even wonder yes. i'm like i used to see this person doing videos with my mom at mm. home cooking mm. then what happened today what is she saying mm. so i really get i i get hurt a lot for me when i'm home i always tell my mom do not do yes. not welcome anybody in terms of youtube when i am here yes. wait until i leave because you people don't listen then you can do what you want to do because personally <laughs> i am tired when she told me that i was like no, no way. I went to ask that. I couldn't even sit down and text her. I was like, I have to ask first to know. Yeah. Like, how is it that she's around and she's a YouTube? I was like, eh, hey. not when I'm around. When I'm around, I don't want to see anybody who creates YouTube videos. Because you know what they do when they come here? They act to be so good. Mm-hmm. Of course, you know. You, you don't know. I know what they have turned to be. <laughs> like JCs. <laughs> you know the JCs? <laughs> JCs. I could, I could. Sleep with her in the house, do everything for her, take her to the, to bed in the river. Everything. But she, has, she has become something else. Something else. I was, you know, I look at it and I'm like, oh my goodness, you know. But so I, her, no, I will, so I used to be like, how many times have I told you not to welcome such many, people? Many, many times, but. All the time when I come back home, I'm like, you see so and so, you didn't listen. Now you see what's going on. This is because of you and Mara. You people (laughs) cause problems to some of us. Me, I have strong boundaries. And when I say no, even my parents know when I say no, it's a no. Yes. Okay, then I was like, "Ah." then daddy said, she's your mom's cousin. So she's basically your aunt. But the way I was angry, I told her face to face, (laughs) me, I don't welcome people who say they do YouTube in this family. I don't even want to see them close to me. (laughs) And that's the truth. So, cousin, don't feel bad. It's because when we welcome people, mm. they come, we I give know. all the hospitality. Later, they turn to be something else. Mm-hmm. And uh, if you'd be watching this video, let us have boundaries. Hey. Even there is one who was brought from South Africa. <laughs> <laughs> and you know me, I welcomed her. Wherever you'd be watching this video, behave well wherever you'd be. And be grateful for the small little things. You know, like Jessie, she's never grateful. She's really spoiling our name outside there. After you cooking for her, hosting her, doing everything. A month, almost two months. Almost two months. She came with no channel. We opened for her channel. Never grateful. Look at how people are. But because we are Christians, because we go to church, we preach the word of God. God pays for us. That's what we say. Because human beings are like that. That's why we keep on preaching to people to know God. When you go, you know God, you love even your enemies. Because the Bible says, love even those who are unlovable. 
because <laughs> but they will finish you eh they finish me but i thank god but i thank god me i always thank god because i've done my part i've done my part by welcoming them i've done my part by giving them food i've done my part by loving them but they go and talk else other things outside there about my family so guys me i'll always welcome them Hey, mama, when you say that, uh, <laughs> no, not only <laughs> you will always welcome them. But now you're bringing problem to yourself and to your family. You see, then those ones who are good will always be appreciative, and uh, and pray for me, and uh, and uh, and prosper. But those bad ones, like now, this is my cousin. I love her. She cannot do bad things to me. But you know, but again, I, I, I was like, if only I knew she's your cousin, I yes. couldn't have reacted that way. Yes. But because I came yesterday, and you are, you know, and I you, came very late, midnight. I was already asleep. Yeah. So, so I, and also my cousin was asleep. So we yeah. do not know that we are close related. And she, me, I've never seen her. She's the aunt. She's a, she's a daughter to my aunt, my really aunt, my dad's. My, my her, her, her her mother uh -huh. and my dad one stomach oh so we are very close okay yeah uh, you remember nyakamiri eh nyakamiri no, you i don't i don't know oh, okay but anyway she's a close relative of ours so please don't feel bad my friend. no it's not feeling bad it's no, because and, and nobody told, told me like yeah. you know me i was like <laughs> eh we haven't met so d comes and like First thing, are you a YouTuber? After our greeting, are you a YouTuber? You know me, YouTubers, YouTubers, they come here. And I'm like, I understand you, do. You see, that's why we are talking about YouTubers. They yeah, have really, yeah, there are people who have If really, I was like you, me, I would even react I was more. taking somebody to court. Somebody, mm -hmm. a young boy who was my pupil in school, decided mm -hmm. to spoil my name mm -hmm. uh, on media. It was very bitter. It was very big. It's very so, <laughs> me, my reaction wasn't easy. But again, I started thinking about it. I was like, you know, at the end of the day, family is just family. You just have to, you know. Mm -hmm. But me, the thing was, when she told me she does YouTube, I was so angry. But if she told me I don't do YouTube, yeah, my reaction could be different. <laughs> I could be like, okay, mm -hmm. you're welcome, blah, blah, blah. What do you come from? Because mostly when I'm, I meet people who are non-YouTubers, like the interaction is always different. You know yes. what I mean? Mm -hmm. But people who do YouTube, I even told her, do not record me without my consent. You know, I told her the first thing. Because what I know is when people come, they are so good. They are so good. But when they leave, it's a different story. You so know? it's better they don't come. <laughs> of course. <laughs> but so, so she's your cousin. So now to me, she's my aunt. Yes. Something like that. Second yeah. cousin or aunt? Aunt. She's just an aunt. aunt. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, I, I don't even know her name, you know, I, like, yeah, you literally. Know In fact, you cannot know her name. Mm -hmm. Because during Mar Marwa's party is when she came. But I think I've ever seen one of the videos, you guys, you are at the river. I think I've ever yeah, seen that. Yes. Okay. Yeah. yeah. That's but. the time she came for, yeah. and we opened her. You had a YouTube or is when you opened her YouTube? I think the time I opened It was YouTube there, but channel. it was not active. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. During that time mm -hmm. is when we went to the river, we did a, a video. Uh, with her then uh, during Mara's party you are not here so she went back but me room. one thing i know like relatives from mother's side they're always good relatives <laughs> yes. you know like it's always like that yes. relatives up there are always nice people yes you know? they cannot do bad things because they know we are close related we need one another so that's why i uh, i told her come so that we can see your channel if it can be boosted so Mm -hmm. You know, something funny with me, yes. I'm very friendly, but to very few people. Yes. Most of the people that come at home, I'm always like, these people, I know them. You know, it's because of what other people have done. Yeah. So even good people, when they come, you still like, no. Yeah. You're like, eh, hey, I cannot take this anymore because of the bad people that came before. Mm -hmm. And what they did, now you're like, uh-uh, enough is enough, mm -hmm. you know? But actually, you welcomed, okay? I didn't know that. Sorry about that, but that is the real me. When I mean business, mm -hmm. I mean business. Yeah. You're not the first person I'm telling that. Many people come and I'm, t I'm like, no, not me. Count me out of that. They yeah. can't even get in because they know for me, I don't mingle with village shenanigans who are just <laughs> yes. ungrateful people who yes. just come here when yeah. they need something. Yes. You know what I mean? After and getting, 
they become wild. Yeah, so it's true. It's true, guys. You know, we come from a big family. Like they are saying, like when they approach me, I'm like, I'm like, hey, D, nice to meet you. D doesn't know even who is talking. Yeah. Come, my cousin, they, we come from a big family. Like my mother. I know, I know. Like it's so big. Kids. Like for me, I don't know some of my cousins. I don't know some of my uncles. Like you understand. Me, I only know Uncle Paul's uh, yeah. kids and Uncle okay. Matiko's kids. The rest, the rest, I don't know them completely. Actually, you know? myself, I don't know some of my cousins, some are in Tanzania, some are in Nairobi. Uh, yeah. We don't know each other, guys. So, mm -hmm. Yeah. Positive energy on me. <laughs> so, sorry about that, but I'm a very friendly people to people that I feel like they are kind of genuine. Mm -hmm. And I'm always skeptical to people who come here in the name of YouTube because I know what they do. Yeah. You know, at the end of it all. We so, <laughs> <laughs> so, that's it. I nearly told that me I cannot stay here if she a person who does YouTube she's in the same house as me me hey. <laughs> not me I was like me I'd rather live right now because me I cannot because sometimes yeah. you know when parents welcome somebody you know to kidogo and malize because sometimes you know when parents welcome somebody sometimes i don't have the power to say like i don't want this person here so i was like if it's their visitor let it be their visitor with their youtube stops me i can be out yeah. because i don't want a problem you know at the end of the day <laughs> I think it's sometimes it's good to be like that. Yes. Because you find mm -hmm. sometimes you welcome a stranger that you don't know the character. Mm -hmm. Later, this person becomes ungrateful. Uh -huh. yeah. Yeah, just to get views. And actually, uh, it's just, not even strangers. Even even uh, relatives, yeah. you cannot say that everyone is good. So Until true. You are with them. Even if you are them today, you are with them today. You know not about tomorrow. And they everything is okay. Yes. You know, tomorrow they come and say, "Eh, uh -huh. this happened and that." And now when they say, "Me, I am congrats, mom, cousin." Mm -hmm. Now it's even worse because they're because like, they, "Oh, they know everything." They know they, they, what these people know. say. It's true, and it's not. <laughs> if you say something about congrats, mom's family, people will believe a relative more than someone else. Yeah, more than someone that else. Is more tricky. Okay. <laughs> Guys, you see what content creation has cost. I nearly yeah. chased uh, my mom's cousin. First <laughs> cousin. You did. You have to pay for that. <laughs> anyway, I'm sorry because I think you know why. I've already explained myself. Yeah. So, okay. You yeah, know? I've understood you. Understood and it's you. because you came late. We could and have also done the went introduction. to upload a video. I came late. Mm -hmm. We could not meet. Yeah, we yeah, could not definitely. meet. So, guys, that's it. Yeah, that, yeah. So okay, tell tell them what you do. Tell them your channel and everything. Okay, beautiful family. My name is Tina Marwa. I go by Tina Marwa on my YouTube channel. I wish I had my phone here, but uh -huh. later, yeah, later, later, later. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. On YouTube. Yeah, on, yeah I've, I've seen you before on Congrats you Mom. You know, during blog. the party, I was here for a month. Oh, for eh, for a month. For a whole month. <laughs> I was really like uh, sometimes here, sometimes at I am Marwa's villa. So I was like in between. Anyway, living here anyway. and then you're I welcome. Got, um, thank you. So, guys, much. you check her out, and also, congrats, mom. So she nice loves you. YouTube. She creates, <laughs> she's so consistent, even more than me. Yeah, <laughs> now there is not so much, but uh -huh. by the grace of God, I'll be giving good contents, guys. So, don't forget, congrats, mom. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, guys, subscribe to their channels. Okay, Mama, another thing. People keep asking me, D, what happened with your mom's car? We see her going to school on a motorbike and all that. Tell them what happened. So, guys, I've been sick, kindly. <laughs> Just understand me. I'm still uh, in the process of healing. Behind. Yeah, Let see. me see the other one. Yes, there's a little bit of difference. Yeah. You're you still healing, though. Yeah, so it was I'm right here, healing, right? So I fear driving when I'm not okay. You fear driving when you're not. Yeah. <laughs> but I personally think you just you just scared. No, uh, eh? You not. just fear. I don't no. know, but that's what I think. No, when I'll be okay, uh -huh. the things will be. Will, will I'll happen. see wonders. Yes. Yeah. Anyway, take your time. No rush. Yes. You know, let the 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 car sleep in the garage until when you are you are ready. <laughs> like uh, when Davy is here now, I, I, from tomorrow we shall take it out slowly. Yeah, yeah, tomorrow. We will yeah. go all of us for a trip. Yes. Yeah, and 
she said Tina Maroa. Tina Maroa, yeah, yeah. yeah. You're welcome, Tina. Feel free, Thank you know? You very much. Beautiful yeah, I love you. my mom so much. So when you tell me you're connected to her, I just, oh, you know, I just it. treat you like hey, her. Mom, yeah. yeah, that is the thing. Yeah. <laughs> Congrats, mom. She's the best. You know, yeah, she's know. she's I'm so good. Here. Actually, that's why I'm here. If so, guys, of, let us make her friend. the watching hours. She's missing mm -hmm. the watching hours. Yeah. Only, guys. So yeah, we're gonna get there. We're gonna create some videos here and yeah, there. So yeah. But in future, if you change, I will blame congrats, ah! congrats, mom. No, I'll tell no, 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 she will not change. No, 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 she cannot do that. Can you ever do that? No, no, no. That no. one is like doing it to myself. Yes. Yeah. Okay, this yeah. video will be evidence. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I, say yes. I can never be. Like, if yeah. I do something bad to congrats, mom's family, it's like I'm doing it to me, myself. Yeah, because yeah. they are so close. Yeah, yeah. So yeah that's because her, your mom, yeah, and my mom and my dad. Your dad. You see, like their yeah, parents so are sisters, are, are brothers and sisters. Yeah. Yes. You one see mother, that? One father. You see, that is very close, yeah. actually. No, actually one. Yeah, my yeah, dad and her mom, mm -hmm. one stomach. That is. Mm -hmm. Your mom is still there. Yes. yes. Oh, that's nice. She's Maybe I should there. visit and up there. Yeah, so. visit is her. she from the family of the Goko with the who who got us the donkeys? You, you know the yeah. Goko, I think I need to Goko, go visit her. You see the Goko and this mother, the storm, they are sisters. Really oh, they are still sisters. sisters. Yeah, they are really sisters. Are you seeing? The <laughs> Goko in TZ. In TZ. And this one same. Mm. Same, yeah, they are sisters. Hey, sisters. That is my favorite Goko. Aki, she was so good. Actually, you, before I travel, I think we need Tanzania. to go and say hello. Yeah, we need have. to go and say hello and visit them. Yes. Hey, she was the best. She used to come with porridge, 20 liters. I know. She's the best. Hey, that yeah. one. Yeah. I will yeah. say I will come go visit her, but I think before I leave, I must go and yeah. say, hey, she's the best. My yes. Yeah. yeah. So I'll find out whether she's in her home or in her daughter's home. Hey, ask if she's, if she she's around. She wants to stay in her daughter's home mm -hmm. because now in her home there was nobody taking care of her. She decided to go to stay with her daughter. Her daughter. So I don't know even if she will know me. Ebu ask, make a call, let me know so that this coming week mm -hmm. we can go and say hello. I think you are around, right? Yeah, we can go we can actually. Go. We can come or we will get lost. I don't no. know. <laughs> <laughs> So let me try to ask mm -hmm. and see if Kaki went. Let me mm -hmm. uh, send Uncle Paul. Hey, wherever she is, Uncle we will Paul go and get us yeah. the answer. I'll send Uncle Paul to go and find where Auntie we is. We can go wherever she to, is. We think it. tomorrow okay. she even needs to come and visit us here because she used to come at the old home. She, now she has never come here because nobody's ready to bring her. She wants to come here. Nobody's ready. But to now bring because her. I'm around and the cars are available, maybe we can we can arrange go and bring her if she's so willing. Tanzania. Yeah, because I'm around, so. Yeah. Because yeah. you know when I'm away at school, now coming to stay alone, she feels not. No, but not because I'm here and she's here, everything yeah. will be okay. Like maybe yeah. She can come even for a week, yeah. the way she wants. I'm telling you, she used yeah. to be the like you know those grandmothers when you are young and you, hey, the porridge used to be the best. Do you know I, the porridge I'm talking know. about? Yeah, and you know what Auntie did to <laughs> me? Uh -huh. She used to love me so dearly, brings me everything. She, she used to buy me a sufuri. Imagine. I remember. I remember. She could come even with unga, with yeah. so many things. She could bring sufuri. Hey, I need to go visit. I don't know if she will remember. I mean, it's long. It's long. You know, my kids were very young. young and yeah, small. like, you know, you under young. 10 years, and somewhere you there. To, you used to. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, this finger used to suck know. it. She used and to suck <laughs> the finger all the time. She used not to talk. And this girl, when she was young, she used to suck the finger and look at the hand. <laughs> she used to suck the finger, imagine. And she used not to talk. So, so when your auntie used to come and say, she used to touch them, the head. <laughs> and say, Mignon is too yeah, much. Yeah, go and buy for them, Mignon. To de talk de -warm. To de -warm them. To de warm them. You can see now where they are. Hey, it's long. The best, uh, the world <laughs> YouTuber. Imagine. Hey, God needs to come and say, hey, she used to be, like, I can never forget. Even... Apart from when I was so young, when I was in primary, she used to come and now I could have sense. When oh. we, when she comes, going home, it's now, you know, a celebration for lunch because we know she has cooked for us. Mm -hmm. There's Uji, yeah. there's everything. Mandazi. So, Mandazi. <laughs> 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 that lady used to come and visit us. Let me she was the say, best. I want to send Uncle Paul to go and bring her here. Instead of us going. Yeah. To bring her if here. she's okay. but now on a motorbike it will be so hard maybe we could go with the car and pick her somewhere somewhere yeah, we shall pick her from your side 
Yeah, let us just go no. from Nyamutiro no. side no. and from pick her side. and come with her. Yeah, so mm -hmm. we want Uncle Paul to wonder whether she's at her home. We shall go up to send Wait, me, if she's at her home, we want to go visit her at her home. Mm -hmm. Then now we come together. Uh, we we bring her. Then now we bring her with the car. Because I want to, I have never even been to, guys, when I was growing up, my parents were very strict. That's why I don't know most of my cousins, yeah. because you don't go there. My dad, hey, it's <laughs> what? Even in Uncle Paul's place, I used to go and come back the same day, you yeah. know? So even knowing cousins and everything, it was hard. Yeah. Because my mom was like, if you know relatives, you won't study. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you will run away and go live there, you know. So my mom was like, no, you stay at home. Home is home until when you are grown up, so you can go and visit them. Mm -hmm. Anyway, mama, so tell Uncle Paul then to make arrangements. Yeah, it's yeah. Uncle Paul whom I'll send. Because I'm not here for so long, so yeah. that, yeah. She can come stay with us for a week. Aoge, she eats well. We appreciate her. Then like, she'll see the importance of uh, having people who are, who are late in life. Yeah, because I cannot forget her. Hey, she was the best. She was, yeah, I mean, she's like my mom. Yeah. yeah. Because she brought me up. Okay. Yeah, because you see, when my my mom died so earlier. For her, years. I can't even remember how she used to look. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So she's the one who used to come and to see us mm. at Nyabuans. Uh, yeah. So that's why I'm feeling like she needs to come and see how things has changed. Yeah, you know, because that time come. used to be a different life. Yeah. Totally different. different. She needs like, to come. She needs to come. She needs to come. I'll see the blessings. Well, so, all right. Today, there are no fruits for you. No, Mama, it's okay. Oh, I just want to go for a okay. test drive a little oh, bit, then, then, then I'll be back. Me. Tina, you're very welcomed, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Okay, and okay, and okay, feel okay, free. Okay, okay. In your YouTube, have that one. <laughs> <laughs> ah, this one is, is not so good. The birds, the oh. birds have done that thing. Oh, they have huh? already eaten. Yeah, but it's okay. When I was here last time, when I good. came, I I had some, so oh. you don't need to worry. Oh, wow. Okay, guys, that was that. So me, I've already eaten and everything. I'm just going for a drive on the road. Yes. I'm doing some practice, and also I want to learn how to ride a motorbike yes. before I leave. Yeah. So, okay, Mama. Don't forget, call Uncle Paul and ask and ask about. I just want to call now. Yeah. Yeah. Nina, go and bring me my bag. There, yeah, Mama. Bring me my bag. Mama, you bad. <laughs> Mama, you bad. <laughs> Mama is something else. Mama is always trying to be strange. Eh? Like yeah, but it's a good thing. But we welcome Tina. You know, Tina is a very close relative. Yeah, me, I know. Oh, you, you know. Yeah, know Why you didn't tell me? Oh, but we didn't see her. Yeah, yeah, sure. You know, I mean, it's so funny how things turn out to be even, even when you least expected. You know what I mean? Because now, I don't know, but that's just me. And I think you guys know me. I have a, you know, I have my own boundaries and I'm so, 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 so strict. Me hanging around with village shenanigans, that's not part of me. When I'm home, I'm home, chill with family. And I love family, you know, family is family at the end of it all. But you see, like that was not so good because I didn't know who she was actually. And that's just me. Like I'm always true to myself. I'll be like, me? Mm -mm. No, no, no. <laughs> but please go subscribe to her YouTube channel. I'll leave her link, support her. I'll do some videos with her here because she's 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 a very close relative, very close. Also from congrats mom's side, you know what I mean? And that means a lot. Don't take that for granted. We're now even planning to go visit our grandma, you know, and bring her home here. So it's going to turn out to be a whole different experience, okay? So that is it for now. I want to go on a test drive. Nene, I'm say hello. Teacher. Yeah. Hello guys, how are you doing? David Junior here. I'm so excited. Today we want to be doing a drive test. We do him one go and soon we want to be getting her driving license. Yeah, it's in so progress. It's in progress. Yeah. So we can't wait. Okay, let me lock my room then take, mm -hmm. take the car out of the garage. All right. Yeah. Okay, let me lock the... Why she's not driving? Yeah, of course. <laughs> it's yeah, our fans. Here. People always ask, like, where is Mama's car? Was it 
maybe a fake surprise. It's it, it was a <laughs> yeah, people always ask me that. <laughs> it was it a fake surprise. Yeah, so sorry. guys, this is David Junior's yeah. Lamborghini. You guys know it. Okay? <laughs> then this is congrats, mom. <laughs> Empress, it's just what chilling. It it's just <laughs> No, but you don't even need to verify yourself, yeah. you know? Mm-hmm. So congrats, mom. Empress is right here so guys. Mm-hmm. Chilling. That's the brand. Chilling. Mm-hmm. Chilling. You know what I mean? <laughs> but soon I'll start driving it, you know, for my yeah. test drives. But mm-hmm. today let me go with this, you mm-hmm. know? But this one looks, I don't know why, but I'm so comfortable driving this. I don't know because it's small. <laughs> yeah, it's a small can. It's kind of girlish, you know? Mm-hmm. Even this one is still okay. Anyway, I'm coming. Let me lock my room. I'm coming. Yeah. La Grand, now you're good. No. <laughs> the reasons as to why i decided to come home is to learn how to drive because being a traveler knowing how to drive is a must so after knowing how to drive the next thing i have to learn how to ride a motorbike because i remember in mexico i really suffered a lot because i couldn't even ride a bicycle or a car so that made my stay there kind of difficult because there are some places where you can't even actually find uber drivers or something like that you have to rent a car or a motorbike for you to keep exploring the country so this is just heads up if you uh, if you're planning to travel the world make sure you can drive 
make sure you can ride a motorbike. Those two things, it's a must. So I'm really proud of myself. I'm trying each and every day. I'm outside. And uh, yep. In uh, in a few, let's say in a few weeks, I'll be having my official driving license to be on the road because right now I have the waiting one. And uh, soon as we hit the road, I'll be able now to rent cars or motorbikes and just keep taking you guys along because I know this is going to save me a lot. So I'm really taking my time to get to know how to drive so properly, how to ride my motorbike. Then I'll be off for the next adventure. Let me know how you think I did it in the comment section. Wow, well, guys. So, oh, Mambo, it's okay. You can say hello. Oh, hi, guys. My name, my name is Mita Richard Maro. Yeah. I'm from this village. Diana is my sister. Yes, Emma. Yeah. Yeah. So Diana. Benta ko ab. I'm asking where is Indugu Benta? Finish. Yeah. Ah. Uh. Diana is my sister. She's strolling. <laughs> yeah, I'm strolling. Yeah. Then I wanted to speak with her. Huh? Huh. Oh. Yeah. yeah. So. <laughs> Guys, make what sure happened? What happened here? You are fighting? No. Somewhere here. I was driving. Then what happened? I was driving a motorbike. Then you fall down? Yes, mm -hmm. I was driving then. You fell down while driving? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. You are my... Where is Benta? Benta is... Motemarabu. Motemarabu. She's married? Yes. Oh, Should okay. I take you to her? Not today. Okay. Later on. Okay. Yeah. I wanted to show them Jamaica right there, then you came back. No, not your tattoo. Jamaica is at the back. Oh. <laughs> yeah. So, guys, mm. make sure mm. you subscribe, comment, like, and share. That is it. Stop. <laughs> to cut. Oh. <laughs> Guys, I wanted to show right there we have Jamaican flag. Young Trend Boutique with Jamaican flag. Jamaica is loved everywhere. Hmm. Yes, guys. So, as you see me, I'm speaking. He's single. <laughs> Ready to mingle. <laughs> <laughs> but if only you stop drinking Changa. Guys, he's a good friend. Not really a friend, but I started with the sister. Even him, same school. Mm. Okay, so maybe mm. I'm going. Good then, job. Because I, I saw you could maybe, if I gave you money, you could drink liquor. So I said, let me buy you the soap that you said you wanted. Yeah. Good job, okay? Yeah, okay. Ah, yeah, so, all the best. Then you stop drinking liquor and work hard. Guys, he's tall, solar and everything. So... I wish him the best. I'm telling him if he stops drinking alcohol, he can be, you know, very, very successful. You see? Mm. So. Aye, so asante. Aye. All right, guys. Later, we are back home. Time to cook. So we bought some chicken at the border. And that's what I'll be cooking today. So as I normally tell you, this is the best way of cooking here in the countryside. Despite the fact, congrats mom has a cooker and everything. Still, this is our most loved way of cooking. Okay, so yeah, we just put water in here to get hot. Then now we'll remove the feathers of the chicken. So see you when the water has boiled. Mm -hmm. Tina. Do you know how to slaughter a hen? Mm -hmm. Not even slaughtering, even touching sometimes I fear. <laughs> touching you fear? Yeah, no. Everybody doesn't want to do that. Yeah, Me no. too, I don't know why. Slaughtering, now yeah. that's the tricky question. Yeah, we bought okay. this from the border. Organic. Very. Full chicken. <laughs> we okay. bought this 1,200. That's like nine, $9 or something. Mm. Now slaughtering. Hmm? Go to you. <laughs> that's where we draw the line. Okay. 
I bring, let me change her then. <laughs> My mom is like, you guys don't want to slaughter the kitchen, who, uh, the chicken, who will be slaughtering for you? <laughs> is ready let us work so now we have to dip in the chicken like that okay yeah that way so that it's easy and let them go go to to nini so when you do this way it's now easy for you to remove the feathers so in the countryside the other chicken we don't have the english chicken this is common fall Yadi, yadi chicken, you know, and it's really expensive when you go buy it from outside. You know what I mean? I mean, when you eat it in the restaurant, it's very expensive. But since I'm home, yeah. I want to bring a cooking stick so that we can, you know, we can turn it over because it's very hot. <clears throat> so you do this way. Here at home you have to know how to cook chicken or else. For a lady, it will not be okay with you. Yeah, like that. And do let us zile yele managu sasa to kalisha sahir. Hello, baby. Men let her viazi. Hello, baby. Just brought Irish potatoes for me. Eka apo hello, baby. Thank you so much. Okay. Yes. Yes, guys. Hello, baby. He's also a relative. But. All right, guys, already removed the feathers. So right now, I'm just making sure the small feathers that remain go away. <laughs> You know, like that. Mm -hmm. It's all at all. Smoke. Because congrats, mom is always doing it. But now she can. Now I have to learn. You have to learn. So, so more then remove this. Completely. Yes. Okay. That. Hmm? And the good thing, the knife is sharp, like that. Yeah. And then onto the next one. Imagine, guys. I don't know how to prepare chicken on my own. <laughs> You have to yeah. learn. Now today is the day. <laughs> because congrats mom, it's, she always does it for no, us. This other side. Yeah, here. Yeah. Yours is to wait on the table. <laughs> See? Uh-huh. Here. Alright guys, it's dark right now. I wanna cook ugali. As you all see, the fire is blazing. The water has already boiled. So now I have to cook ugali. Then right here, open for them to see. Too. Right here we have chicken boiling, as you all see right there. So, so cover it again. Okay. So now I need to cook ugali, quick and fast. Yeah. As 
highlights guys this is flour we just add on the boiling water on the boiling water like that so that's how you add your cooking flour you keep stirring as you keep going on this side Yoni yeah, Atina huh? in applaud. Yeah. Okay guys, so now it's mixing time. On the borong a bit later when you mod the sharp to a cap of a cuckoo. So say up on the cross. So guys, this is how we cook a gari. I think you've seen me cooking before. It just keeps stirring. Like that. So you also know how to cook with fire? Yes. You can't miss it. No. Yeah. <laughs> it's a must. And it's even easier. Yes, it's even it's easier, easier than quicker than, than the, the house. Cook, even the now I'm getting addicted. I don't want to cook in the big kitchen. I'm like, I just want to cook out here. Alright guys, as you all see, my ugali is now ready. See how I'm turning it? And do you see how my cooking stick is clean? It's not sticking. That is to say, the food is ready. No? And also even you can see how the pot looks like on the other side. You see how it looks on, on this side? It means it's ready. So I turn it one more time. Then that will be it for the ugali. I don't know if I should give it some two minutes, maybe, right? Mm -hmm. Just a little bit. Come on, yeah. add. Mm. So the other side to go. Yeah. It? It's already. Sm is it smelling? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you can hear. I just wanna taste. Mm -hmm. It's ready. Mm. That's like I see noise. Yeah. All right, guys. Now I'm taking off my ugali. Actually. I can even take it off like this. You see, like this. It can't fall down. <laughs> I'm a pro, just like that. See? Then I don't want the pot to overcook, to overheat, I mean. I take it away like that and put it on the other side. So now, the next thing, actually, the ugali is so. So delicious. I must eat in Ugali. Mm -hmm. Then you shape it. Mm -hmm. then I it like this. And just like that, I finished mm -hmm. cooking. My onions were ready. I added in some garlic. So now, tomatoes follow. You know what I mean? It looks like there's strong fire on the other side. I'm trying to reduce. Okay. Okay. So now I give my tomatoes some time to cook. So now I will add the chicken then you cover like that so on this other side now i'm cooking on two fire i have this and this so come coming back here i had just added in my onions 
they are ready actually time to add in tomatoes how about the garlic ah do you have some more yeah just great then i'll throw in that is on yanya so now i want to add in my tomatoes just like that okay so the thing is i give them also time to cook but i think i'll have to add a little bit of cooking oil so that so that uh, they can cook well and also it doesn't stick on the cooking pot mama you don't you haven't started putting milk in in, in vegetable just yes. like that you can bring the so milk has not been boiled you have to boil first okay later uh, i think we are done here so give them time to cook also so now i just have to carve oh some garlic okay yeah garlic is so good mm -hmm. a little bit of garlic right there that's garlic okay wow then we just let's go there let's go then we come back here and uh yeah check on it see cooking properly firewood is the best way of cooking so fast you see how the chicken has cooked mama you can even see the meat has gone you know the meat on the bone you can see wow already boiled boiled chicken guys wow guys mm -hmm. looking so good so nice and delicious that is it Yeah, big tutorials cook fast and like small ones in the chicken or oh, the hoho. Let's throw in the hoho, the sweet pepper. Come and throw for me. Yeah. So now we're adding in the sweet pepper, just like that. Yeah. Because we also have uh, waru, that is Irish potato. Mama, you are gone. <laughs> no, I want to have to come and see. <laughs> you want her to come and see? Yeah, she has to see. Bring waru. I can put the chicken, then add in the waru. Come and see. You see how we cooking? You add everything. You see, you let the the, the tomatoes cook properly. So now guys, we add it in the chicken like that. There we go. Let's add in the Irish potatoes. Let it be heavy. And the coriander. Yeah. Okay, four Irish potatoes. That is it. Well mixed. Now I need water. Let's a magic jug. Oh, the coriander. Yeah, yeah put. Bring the coriander. We could even still put it at last. No, oh, still it's okay, okay. okay. Yeah, because it doesn't need to cook. Wow. What do you guys think? Bring water. You have warm water. Fire pour. Keep pouring. Keep pouring like that. Yeah. This. Add, add a little add, bit. Add. Yeah. Add. The whole of it. Okay. Yeah. It now, like that is it. Yeah. Bring salt. Then I cover. Wow. Looks so good. Okay. You are a chef and a half. <laughs> add a little bit more. Chef, chef. Because the soup. Is a lot. For it. Yeah, just, you know, look, the portion is so small. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> okay, ah. that's <laughs> because there's ah. a lot of water. Ah. Yeah, congrats, Mom. Because you see, the soup is a lot, and we need it to cook. You know, Mama, look. Yeah. <laughs> Your cousin no, okay. is scared of salt. Anyway, no, that's okay. okay. I think so. Yeah. All right, guys. After adding in salt, now I cover. Yeah. Cover like that. We we'll give it time. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Now put a lot of firewood. Here. Now here. Take here. Take here. Let's go here. Yeah. We come back here. Yeah. Doing good. So now, the next sure. thing is I have to pound. The tomatoes. I have to add what now. Fire. Yeah, they've actually cooked. You know? And now, I don't have the cover. Yeah, it's still cooked. And now, we mix everything. Mix so delicious. Yeah. the veg very delicious and ready so put them in the hot pot yeah. ready to be eaten Because of the skin. <laughs> yeah. Turn the other side. Yeah, so I'm almost there. I think the potatoes are a bit red because that's what you're waiting Until they become unga, like so soft. And what do you think? Maybe yeah, almost, almost there. Almost. almost. So I cover one more time. Yes. Yeah. One more time. Okay guys, I'm also adding coriander because it's almost ready. Alright guys, as you all see, now the chicken is ready, well cooked. So now it's time to put it down. Look at the soup. Yeah. Well cooked. I just placed water there so now I need to pour the chicken into the hot pot ready to eat can you guys see yeah. well cooked even the soup now looks less <laughs> I need one more okay look at that so now there we go Soup looks less. Eh? The soup is less, but right? It's okay. But it's okay. Mm -hmm. Where's the hot the cover? Okay, that is it, guys. Now we're going to the table to eat. Chef of the day. <laughs> I think I'm going oh, to yes. add more water here. Time to eat. Mm. 